and welcome everybody here in twitch chat and everybody on youtube for some twisted yasuo it's our first deck of the day we got three donation decks to play today and then we'll be going with um illusion misfortune deck af after that a deck that uh, some people on um youtube were asking about so i wanted to play that um but first Twisted Yasuo. So as you can see from our card selection here, we are almost in an Ionia deck. Like, you know, we're mostly all Ionia. 35 Ionia, only five Bilge Waters. We're just playing the three Twisted Fates and two Yi Ben Warns. Um, sorry, two Yi Ben Warns, which is actually pretty nice in this kind of deck. So give an enemy vulnerable. If it dies, draw a card. It's kind of, we can kind of use that as removal where Ionia doesn't have that much removal. And giving, giving, um, the enemy's vulnerable is pretty nice with all of our quick attacks. You know, the Blade Twirler having quick attack, and then Twisted Fate and Yasuo, both of our champions, also having quick attack, uh, <clears throat> allows us to um, uh, get rid of those vulnerable things uh, pretty easily. We have the same kind of thing with Sonic Wave, uh, being able to give our, our units Challenger and pumping them up. Um, but yeah, so we're mostly all Ionia. We got a bunch of spells, you know, three retreat, three Sonic Wave. It'll be interesting to see how both of those two cards really play out. Um, but we got like the reliable ones we know are going to be good. Uh, Twin Disciplines, Concussive Palm, Will of Ionia, Spirits Refuge, Deny. You know, like, these are all going to be good, but they're all kind of expensive and we need some cheaper uh, spells and interaction and stuff like that. Um, we got six, six two drops, so then we got a couple of Claws and an Eye of the Dragon. Eye of the Dragon is the kind of card that... It's not always necessary, not always useful. Um, it's a nice little one of though, because there are some games where it can really help and, and really do a lot. And of course, the Draglings are nice. They pair well with our Sonic Waves and our Yeeben Warned as well. So it's a nice little one of. Um, but of course, we're gonna be trying to win the game on the back of our champion, Yasuo. Um, that's gonna be our most powerful card. Twisted Fate is just a really good uh, Swiss Army Knife that can kind of do a little bit of everything and uh, at the very worst help us dig towards Yasuo. And then we got our, our finishers with Yone and Mina Swiftfoot that can help put games away. So let's give us a try. So we're going to go play over in Ranked. We're going to go play five games. We are two wins away from Master Rank. So if we can um, just win our first two, we'll be at Master's. Um, you know, if if not each each loss that we have will mean another win that we need. What's up, Mike? Hello, hello. Uh, we're going to go ahead and mulligan this hand. I could see keeping a Will of Ionia, Bromzed. I'm glad that they're not attacking turn three. Um, I could see keeping a Will of Ionia, like to bounce Zed or bounce Brom. But I'll just go ahead and send them all back and... Give us our best chance at finding Yasuo, which is exactly what we did. Quietly. Think you're fast? Cute. Quietly. That means you can. So this could be a good opportunity for me to just use Sonic Wave. Give this challenger. Pump it up. So we get to play the 3 2. So we just traded one for one. You know, like we traded Sonic Wave for the 2 1, but then we also got the 3 2 into play burst speed and was able to attack with that uh, very quickly as well. Um, if I don't do anything, it's possible they just pass as well. I want to go Blade Twirler Deep Meditation, honestly. No, because that'll only give me six mana next turn. Hmm. Hey, Big Alfredo. Giga Shots. Tumble Dog. Hello, hello. Uh, no patch this Thursday. The patch will either be next Thursday or the Thursday after. It'll either be the 23rd or the 30th. 
it looks like it will likely be the 23rd because that's when the um, that's when the lab ends so that's whenever I would imagine that it will likely be the patch but um, quick footwork fast strikes don't let the fluffy not this week these are dangerous lands. Four mana still, huh? I face my fate. Your turn. I wanted them to spend mana before, um, like I, I wasn't gonna be able to do this and have mana for Will of Ionia. Anyway, and so I wanted them to spend mana first before. Um, before I did that, so that's why I played the Blade Twirler first. First we fight! Listen, be friends! Have you met my shield? <laughs> hmm. Seven mana is so awkward. Really want eight mana. For a champion plus Will of Ionia. The Steel Tempest. I wish I could go with the Steel Tempest. I wish we could um, even like stun our own thing. Like if I attack and then they have like a pump spell, then I stun my own thing. But we can't do that. It's all just pretty awkward. It's our curve reasonably well. All right, so next turn we'll have seven, so we can have eight mana. Red card it honestly doesn't do that much for me. So I'm go blue card and draw another card. One. Blue as the serpent. And basically I want to get Twisted Fate and play as, you know, early before playing like deep meditation and stuff. Just kind of give them something else to worry about. Yone is a good draw. We can play this and we can still play Steel Tempest. That's pretty nice. You have taken a dark path. You never did believe me. Underestimate. I 
dare you. That's going to happen, and oh, it's on. So I'm going to trade one Blade Twirler away. So Yasuo is at three out of five. Ooh, Concussive Palm's nice. Now Shadow Assassin can block the Hatchling. So this evades 4 out of 8. Alright, so I play this. Next turn we have 11 mana. Wish we had 12 with double, you know, double Will of Ionia and Concussive Palm. I, mean, I could just not play anything. And we have 12. Try to keep up. I mean, you can just freely attack. And they just block their 1 1. Um, I'm gonna pass. I'm gonna keep the extra mana. <clears throat> and not make it as obvious that I'm gonna level up this Twisted Fate quickly. Okay. So. The problem here with Braum is that if I just stun Braum, they level up Braum. Um, right, they were going to do that. So we're going to... Bounce that thing, then bounce Braum. Five. Oh, that'll, that'll just be a fifth. It won't level up. Darn it, that's not going to level up Yasuo. It's, I forgot. That you, you have to have five and then strike afterwards. That's just going to be the fifth strike. All right, well, that's kind of a bad Will of Ionia, actually. Yeah, that's actually a bad Will of Ionia. Um, okay, so. This works. We're going to not get the 3-2, but this should work. Underestimate. I dare you. Now we should have leveled up Yasuo be able to kill Braum. If the journey doesn't get you the road right. No cure. Destiny way. Now who's got the upper hand? Perfect. Perfect. That worked out well. Okay, so now we have six out of eight. Twisted Fate. Let's make that eight out of eight. Looks like I'm on a hot streak. Um. Cost seven. Darn. I can't retreat this and replay it. it. Needs to cost six. Um. Eyes open. All right, GGs. Yeah, like we're just gonna take over there. So it's pretty nice playing a Yasuo Twisted Fate deck against a deck that's not really playing removal. That seemed like a pretty good matchup. Alright, one more win. Final boss time already.
Just starting the stream off. Already final boss time. GG's. Um, one win to Masters, yep. Just, just do them both, Big Alfredo. Just put them both in there. All right, and our, we have to have a twist of fate mirror. They're going the dark side with Swain, while we're going with Yasuo. This looks like another good hand to mulligan everything. I, again, Will of Ionia is the only card that kind of considering, but we'll just send it all back. Yeah, both of those cards, both Yasuo and Twisted Fate, are huge threats if they're not removed. <clears throat> and opponent didn't really remove either. They were just focusing on buffing their deck. Um, just worth playing. Nah. Eh. Hmm. Nah. Eh. Skill and grace to tear your breath away. Maybe, maybe not. We'll see. The dragon remembers. Eh, not really. Okay. Stow the rations! Shackle the princess! Think you fast? Cute. And I'd, I'd rather just save these Twin Disciplines. Like, yeah, I could have saved that 3-2, but it's just a 3-2. Um, I'd rather save these Twin Disciplines. With their, their deck's going to be doing a lot of damage and stuff. Um, I'd rather just save it. Homeowner with the Tier 1 sub. Thank you so much, Homeowner. Welcome to the channel. Thank you kindly. I appreciate that. Hey, what's up, Biz? I am doing great. Thank you. Hope you're doing great as well. Mm. Your attack is obvious. Oh, that's our first sub of the day. I didn't reset this from yesterday. Mabi. So seven mana. Try to keep up. Not you. The person that does the Yasuo voice is also a gamer on Twitch. Nice. That's good. <laughs> What's up, Viz? Start playing RuneScape and you're addicted. You gotta escape that RuneScape. I'm always up for a round or two. Eyes open. It's only Grant's vulnerable for a turn, right? You know. Lucky, drawing champions. I wish we could draw a champion. Champions are definitely cards to mulligan hard for in our deck. And that is exactly what we did. We mulliganed pretty hard for our champions. How would this be a bad block? With I'm gonna do six damage. Oh, it's on. Probably not likely. Did. 
They did. The, the previous turn I played the Sonic Wave, and I really wish I would have played the, played the Even Warren because I would have had that one extra mana that I ended up needing pretty bad. With that other Twin Disciplines. really unfortunate. Yep, always punished. Our deck's gonna kind of go how our champions go, right? Like, they... <laughs> our deck without champions... Uh, not looking good. Our deck with champions, like last game, looked really strong. doing they get to stun with the warning shot I should have just bounced I should have just bounced Swain to start with luck is smiling you cannot win They should have just warning shot me and then gotten all this damage in. The only reason why they wouldn't do that is if they have... Oh, come on. The only reason why they wouldn't do that is if they had um, Riptide Rex. And if they have Riptide Rex, I am certainly dead. These arachnoid sentries have been great. Gotta go with the flow. Maximus! Glad to have you here, Maximus. All right, so there we go. There's some. We got two donation decks. One from Colby. One from Big Alfredo. Thanks, y'all. Yeah, rain and donation decks and subs. All these notifications. Yep. Looks like I'm on a hot streak. Yep, the game's officially over now. It's been pretty over ever since. Um, ever since I couldn't protect the big blade twirler. Didn't see that coming. And Stormy Van with the donation deck. All right, gotta write all these down. If y'all can, let me know what what you what's your deck also, so I can write I can just write down what your deck is, if y'all can. Always prefer that also whenever y'all do the the donation deck. Let me know just what it is. So Colby, Big Alfredo. And Stormy Van. Yours is Shen Li? Okay.
War Mothers. All right. All right. Got Twisted Fate this time. That's good. Swift Foot gone. Deep Meditation gone. And I'll keep these two. Vi to Infinity. And beyond. All right. Um... Anybody have any preference on what, what day theirs played? Theirs is played? Um, you know, we can do tomorrow on... You know, I can just plug them in tomorrow. Can do another day as well, if y'all have any kind of preference. Hey, Shreeb. Using this as a card draw spell... Basically, one mana draw card. The dragon remembers. Okay. Tomorrow's an early stream, and then Thursday is um, a late stream like this. If if y'all prefer the later stream, Thursday's late stream. You lack subtlety. Just keeping that from getting like the Sejuani trigger. I go where the road takes me. So basically I just passed turn to make them waste their turn, right? So like they didn't do anything on turn four. Um, I know I could, obviously I could have attacked him for four, but I kind of, like they probably had like this babbling beard or something, you know, like they were probably wanting me, like gonna have me attack and then do something else afterwards. I'm not sure exactly what, but. Um, basically decided to simply wait. Dare you. Beer was the top deck. Carved from the savage cold. So I can still have brittle steel. Um Pick on someone your own. I don't want to risk the Twisted Fate dying. Then this gives them Elixir of Iron. This is probably just a bad play. About to get two for one with Brittle Steel or Elixir of Iron, aren't I? It's probably a bad play. I could have at least done that. I could have at least waited on that and had Concussive Palm be able to kill this thing. Brother, what have you become? If I told you, would you listen? Come for you. That was probably a bad play. Victory requires a sharp blade. I'll cut them apart. Face me. Oh, still. That hurts. I fight with my spirit, not my 
my fist. Our strength is yours. These old eyes still see far and clear. Hmm. <laughs> Yay, another Yasuo. I will unite the Freljord. Today, Ash, you'll see true leadership. So bouncing Trifarian Assessor. Hmm. Cause like if I go Mina Swiftfoot, like obviously I bounce Ash. I guess I bounce Sejuani. And then like Hearthguard, I guess. Gotta trust your instincts. Um I'll return home, Gaslow. You know there's nothing for me there. Born for conquest. Play this instead. And then this is me taking uh, six, which I guess I should be stunning the six three, not the five six. I was thinking, the reason why I stun, like, I mean, I take one more damage. The reason why I want to stun the 5-6 is because now it has, now Sejuani has four health, so now Sejuani dies to this, and so, like, now uh, Mina Swiftfoot would kill all these things. So they, they already did the, the GG thing, so they, they definitely think they're going to win. I assume they were going to go Culling Strike then also, but they didn't do Culling Strike. Oh, right, because then going zero power on Yasuo strikes for zero. Right. Winter take you. Right. Frostbite's really underrated. I say that every time I play Frostbite stuff. It is very good. I'll lead us to victory. Oh, Kordak with the donation deck. Our banner will lead the way. Okay. 
core deck. Now, what is your deck? Y'all start. Say like what your deck is and stuff. Also, when, when you do the donation deck, and give give me any kind of information about when to play or any, anything. Oh, okay. You don't know what it is. Okay. Okay, it's Big Alfredo's Teemo deck. It's Teemo Wayfinder? Okay. Alright, cool. Hey Moonlight, I'm doing good. How are you doing? The really bad play I had there was the attacking the 1-3 into the 5-1 with them having the one mana where Brittle Steel or Elixir of Iron would blow me out and they had the Brittle Steel. That was that was the really bad play that um, really set me down. Um, yeah. Could not have done that. And obviously the Reckoning was rough, but Frostbite deck's good. Yeah. I mean, I could see keeping the Sonic Wave to be able to, to join in with the Yasuo to be able to kill one of their things. But, like, that's, that's in four turns, and I definitely would not want another Sonic Wave if we would draw another one. It's just worth it to mulligan it. In position. Think you're fast? Cute. With having Twisted Fate in hand, I want to see more one health things and not a Crimson Disciple whatsoever. Oh, there's Crimson Disciple. Um. Pick on someone your own speed. Do you think Riot making leveled Yasuo actively worse against Frostbite was intentional? Hard to say. I don't... I don't think that they mind that it is, but I don't think they actively sought out a way to make leveled up Yasuo worse. I just think that it, it turns out that level Yasuo is worse against Frostbite, and that's not really something that is a, that big of a deal that they mind. So Crimson Disciple is really rough. Prevents me from red carding effectively. Dark beckons. 
things never dull. Routes closed. I don't know why I'm not attacking with Shadow Assassin. I meant to. I just didn't click over Shadow Assassin. Obviously, I know, I know. Obviously, I should be attacking there. Should, they should be at 17. There's no reason not to attack with Shadow Assassin. Oh, come on. I really... Did, I really wish I didn't attack, but I mean, I guess we got rid of the transfusion, but I really wish I had that three extra mana. Um, you know, I kind of wish I would have just done that maybe pre-combat and then not played Shadow Assassin if they would have done that. Um, don't really have options. I think Twisted Fate Gold is just simply worse than casting Will of Ionia. I guess Twisted Fate Gold would kill it, but I won't... I mean, this, my, my play here is me going down to one, basically. That's my play. Right, so now my play is me being dead. Terrain here is opinionated. If I don't block with Yasuo, I'm dead. Wanna see these moves up close? We're trying to survive. Let me show you what I can uh, do. That's such a problem for so many reasons. now and then deep meditation I would prefer another deny I'd also prefer to have this have the 6-6 in play before I go lifesteal. So maybe I should have just played Yone last turn instead of this plus draw. Because we 
are needing to lifesteal. Guess I can only lifesteal three. Gotta trust your instincts. I don't know. I don't know what to do. I'll do what must be done. This does give me double concussive palm and spirits refuge in case they have harrowing. I at least have that. Um. Would playing Yone be better than double concussive palm? So, all right, so we go concussive palm, concussive palm. Then I have. Nah, it's probably better to go Yone. Patience and virtue make a true swordsman. Probably better to have the six the other six six blocker. Explosives primed. Wheel. Looks like I gotta do that. Looks like this is me being dead. Darn. Yeah, I can't stay alive. This is me taking two damage no matter what, no matter how I block. There's not a there's not a block that, that keeps me from taking damage. Because of Twisted Fate. Twisted Fate can't block anything. If it blocks a Crimson Disciple, I lose. If it blocks one of these things, I lose. If it, and it can't block the two one, so I only have so I can't I can't win. I can't I can't stay alive. Like those have to block there, these have to block here, and Twisted Fate can't block. That's crazy that they had, you know, harrowing plus two other lethal threats this turn, and I can't I couldn't deal with all of them. Yeah, one more mana I could recall Twisted Fate. Look what you no, cause I don't think the double I don't think the double concussive poem was necessarily right because of those overwhelms. It, If I would have gone double concussive, I would have lost immediately. Because if I go double concussive and then they play the two one, then I, I wouldn't have had anything for that two one. I would I would have been dead before they had the or sorry when they when they played the the Legion Saboteur, I would have been just dead. So I mean it was it worked out really well that I did play the Yone, so I wasn't dead to Legion Saboteur, but then I was dead to I was dead to the Precious Pet afterwards. The I think the real play that I messed up was whenever I played the uh when I when I concuss a palm the Crimson Disciple originally when I had the seven mana I needed to just play the six six and I played I played the concussive palm plus the um plus the deep meditation. I needed to play the six six so I could untap and just put the lifesteal barrier on the six six and go to seven. That was the play that I messed up.
it's difficult. One little tiny mistake like that, like the um, these last two games have made one little tiny mistake, and and that's it. That's it. Can't make can't make one little tiny mistake. Their deck doesn't have a ton of removal for Yasuo. I think this Yiben Warned could be good in this matchup. Achilles, where are you? Uh, being able to help me have Yasuo take out like a Maokai. Yeah, harrowing, harrowing's busted. You know, we had deny for the first harrowing, that a second harrowing. It's tough. Our decks definitely felt a lot less powerful than the last couple of decks we've been playing against. You know, we played against two of the two of the most popular decks with the set with the frostbite deck and and then that Noxus deck and. Um, both those Noxus, I mean, they're both Noxus decks. They both feel a lot more powerful than what we're doing. But that's kind of what the metagame is right now. Noxus is is really dominating when you look at the meta stats. Um, you know, like the all of the top decks are Noxus decks, and every single region's best version is that region with Noxus. <laughs> like Ionia's best deck is Ionia Noxus. Um, you know, PNZ's best deck is PNZ Noxus, and and it just and it goes, it's all of them. Frelly Ward's best deck is Frelly Ward Noxus. Shadow Owl's best deck is Shadow Owl's Noxus. It's crazy. Yeah, like, like a Nivea Braum is good, but like Shadow Owl's Noxus is better and Frelly Ward Noxus is better. Like those are both better than, than a Nivea Braum. And of course, like with the, with the win rates and meta and the meta stat stuff um uh yo uh the minotaur is a noxus card we can't we cannot play the minotaur in this deck it is a noxus card Yeah, PNZ Ionia is like 50% win rate, and both Ionia, like Ionia Noxus is, is good, and then PNZ Noxus is, is like 52%. It's still, it, those are both still better than PNZ Ionia. The only, the only region that has a better, better win rate with something else the wind, but watch is... Back. The Demos is Bilgewater actually. Bilgewater plus Demacia is like 0.2% better than Bilgewater plus Noxus. So basically the exact same. But yeah, Demacia Noxus is better than Demacia anything else. Here's the here's the site that I'm talking about. Mobilytics. Said that the stats are real limited. I mean, I don't know. There's 19,000 matches with one region, 18,000 with the next, 17,000 with another, 6,000, 6,000, a couple with 2,000 because they're not played very much. That's still a lot of games. 4,600, 6,000. Those are the top nine regions are all those, but then yeah, the Ionia PNZ has eleven and a half thousand, five thousand, eight thousand, six thousand. Yeah, you, know, you don't look like the single singular regions, those don't have very much, but I mean that's that's a lot of games. Right. Well, I mean, they can't. I mean, that's not. Yeah, sure. It's not every single game ever played ever. I mean, it's not perfect. But I mean, come on. We're talking about like eighteen thousand games there for just the one for the one region. Like, I mean, what? How, how can you expect better stats? 
than that. Yeah, sure, it's not, it can't, yeah. it's not absolutely perfect, because, yeah, they don't, they don't record, you know, they miss games and stuff and, and things like that, but. For us externally, there's not really a better source. Life and death on a blade's edge. Yeah, it has a 132,751 games, that's. It's more than I play. <laughs> Just a little bit. Got to uh, I don't... I mean... I should kind of be... Like, maybe I should use Sonic Wave? I don't know. This attack, like, isn't even good. Whatever. Whatever. I'm just gonna pass. When you look at the um, Noxus Shadow Isles deck, the absolute worst win rate it has is against um, the Freljord Ionia Elusives deck, and it wins 47% of the time. So it's a it's a coin flip, and that's the absolute worst matchup it has. The second worst matchup, according to this, is Shadow Owl's Ionia, which is 49%, 48.5. Definitely a coin flip. And then the only other one under 50% is... Is 49.8%, so that's not even under 50%, that is 50%. And all the rest are quite favorable. Better just stun that thing. It's probably better just to stun that thing. You know, play Concussive Palm instead of playing Twin Disciplines. to go. Alright, so wait, so that thing's about to turn into a 7-7. Seven, seven. Hmm. So they can play like Jettison, turn this thing into a 7-7, seven, seven, and then I'm going to Twin Disciplines to get the plus 3, plus 0, and I still have Deny available for like Vengeance or anything like that. That's their plan. Alright, so their plan's Vengeance. Let's Deny that. So definitely, so like that's why I didn't want to play Yone, is because I wanted to make sure we could counter a Vengeance.
Alright, so now Twisted Fate level up. I, yeah, the reason why I didn't use the the fleeting card on the Shadow Assassin is because I'd rather have the I'd rather have the extra mana to help out all these spells that I have in hand. I, I, you know, like we had three mana, I'd rather bank three mana than use one mana to do two damage. Um. All right, playing this. Hmm. The thing. All right. So all right. We'll just do Yone. The thing about doing Yone. The the problem with doing Yone is that then I don't get the extra one mana from this blue card now. But I guess. I guess that was a point towards playing the Resonant Strike last turn. Is that blue card? If I go pick a card, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I don't know. I don't think these are great to play, but I want to play stuff because of Twisted Fate. But none of them are great to play. I dare you. So Could have been bad against Ruination if they have Ruination to play that thing. The water rises. And th this was the card. That, this was the reason not to play Will of Ionia the previous turn and play Yone instead. Okay, they tossed the ruination. I didn't. I didn't even see that bishop flick because we're, we're talking and everything. So thanks, thanks there, bishops. Oh, they tossed two for a Doctor Grindel. Oh, well, that's even better for me. It's even less that I need to worry about them. So, it's probably... They're just waiting to play all this stuff. Oh, Keel Breaker. They're just waiting to play all this stuff until I red carded. Still don't like any of my options. Oh, this is bad. This is bad. Cause now the thing's gonna die. That's that's bad right there. That's bad. Okay, I shouldn't have played that. That was bad.
Okay, we need to get back into this. I've not I've not played these last couple of turns particularly perfect. I have not. We have one deny left. I really want that deny. Really want that deny. Deny. I, we already did red card. What do you mean? We red carded way before they played all that stuff. I couldn't. I didn't have another red card. No, I'm not going to save Twisted Fate. I have I have two Twisted Fates in hand. I'm not really casting the figure card too much. I'm so... Twisted Fate can die. It's fine. I got two more. They're about to put three 8-8s eight into play, and I do need to worry about three 8-8s. Eight And that's why I was thinking that this thing, I mean, I guess this will only be a 7-2, but that'd be close. So give this thing life steal for the 7-2. left anyway, right? The Isles will bloom again. Or I just had four because that's what it said. At last, I have found you. Yone, turn back while you can. Here's our chance. I really wanted that deny for the eight, you know, for like those eight eights. Man, they're just passing the turn. Some of them are gonna tap out, and uh, this Yiben Warren would be safe. I feel like this Yiben Warren's kind of risky. If I if I challenge the other way, if I you know have my Yasuo kill the Maokai, which is more safe, then they can have the six one and eight one just trade, and I do deal zero damage to them. I'd rather deal the damage to them. The endless march. All of our stuff draws cards. Which isn't great, by the way. 
So basically, I have to kill them next turn, and I can't play stuff pre-combat next turn. Yuck, how do I do that? I guess we need Yasuo Steel Tempest. Um... So we'll get blue card. Oh, wait. Yeah, okay, yeah. I thought I'd... Okay, yeah. We're good. Yeah, because the blue card will give me the extra mana for the Steel Tempest. Shuffle that back. Or into the deck. Okay. Recall on Yone could be good. No! Seriously? I need that Yone. I can't, though. I can't keep it. Worth both I can't. Lives. If I if I cast Retreat, I lose. Right here. No! They're smart for not attacking. It doesn't let me steal Tempest. That's a very smart non-attack. Oh, right, that just kills me. I need, you know, they just had to attack. They didn't. That was a very good non attack. Soak it in. You can't shuffle Twisted Fate. How do you think shuffling Twisted Fate's gonna work? Because huh. it doesn't work. Because you, to, to shuffle Twisted Fate, you have to cast Pick a Card, and Pick a Card re requires you to draw three, and that, we do not have three to draw. We could put one back and draw three. That's not, that's not a winning formula. Um, yeah, we're, we're not going to be able to draw three, so I can't cast the Pick a Card. Yeah. Um... Yeah, I mean, I could have done that right there, in, you know, before, like, that's my first thing, so then the blue card doesn't kill me, but I I can't do I can't do enough damage to kill them. I just don't have enough mana, because I, I would need to, like, I would need, one, them to have zero cards in hand and not have a single thing, and then, two, I would need to be able to pick up Concuss Concussive Palm, replay it, pick up Concussive Palm again, replay it again, and it just, that's just so much mana, like, that's, that's too much mana, and they have to have nothing. Um, yeah, the Maokai hit us hard, especially, like, right after the Maokai, all of our cards, like, what, we had, like, Deep Meditation, Shadow Assassin, you know, like, those were, what, three, three draws in a row, I guess, were, what, Shadow Assassin, Deep Meditation, Shadow Assassin? It's like, no. Um. The turn, whenever they play, whenever they attacked with all the 8-8s. Eight I mean, one thing that would have definitely helped is if I did not attack with my 6-6 six, six and get the 1-1 one, one to block it, so then it turned into a 6-5, so then it died. That was a dumb mistake. Um, looks like they had the Withering Whale, though, so they would have killed it with the Withering Whale. Um. Oh, that's a, good, that's a good card. We'd trigger the gold card. 
I don't know. This is this is not an easy deck to play. I mean, I feel like I make like one little mistake every single game, and then that's it. Then then we're dead. Um, su super difficult to play. Um, you know, you really can't make any. Your margin for error just looked like zero. Like if I, you know, yeah, I'd make one little mistake, and then boom, dead. Um, I I definitely like Yasuo with Noxus more. I don't think that um, like even Ward was tough. Like this this card was it was rough. This this cost me a couple of times. This was really difficult to pull off. Um, you know, it's so slow, and then your opponent knows exactly what you're doing and exactly how to set it up. That was tough. Deny was awesome. We needed more denies, honestly. Deny was, um, it was really good whenever we had, you know, like we stopped a Vengeance, we stopped a Harrowing, but we needed more in this deck. Like, we, need, we needed more denies. Um, each time, you know, like we'd, we'd stopped a Vengeance, and then we died to the, the deal 5 to everything, or the 5 mana make 3 8 eights, or... You know, we stop one harrowing and they have another. Um, but I, it didn't feel like playing bilge water was really worth it, and the the deck lacked power, being basically all Ionia. Um, like Sonic Wave was very average or below average, um, probably just below average. Like this cost us quite a bit, and then like there's a game where we where we just lost because all we had we had you know drew like three sonic waves in one game and this car is pretty below average retreats very average claw like a lot of these cards are just very average um and yeah i just feel like we could use more power than what we have um so yeah that's uh it's not necessarily that our deck need like the it's Yasuo deck needs Yasuo a lot. It's like that's obvious. Like obviously Yasuo decks benefit from Yasuo, but that's not really what this. That I wouldn't really say that that's really what was going on here. It's just our our cards were. We didn't we didn't have enough power with these cards, and so if you make one little mistake, you're done for, and you need a lot of things to line up. Like like Sonic Wave's a cool little trick that you maybe have as a one of, maybe a one of. It's not a three of. Like, three ofs are, are cards you want every single game all the time. I was saying retreat, same thing. Maybe, maybe a two of with retreat, but probably not. But not a three of. Um, you know, there's just not, not the power to close out games in here. Okay, uh... That's Twisted Yasuo. They're not all going to work out, and that's okay. Um, those of y'all watching later on YouTube, hit that like button over there. Feel free to leave those comments as well. Um, but anyway, thank you so much for watching some Twisted Yasuo, and I'll see you for the next video.